Hey, hi, in this video, I will show you how you can upload a file to Azure Blob Storage using PowerShell, okay? Where uh, a file which I'm uploading to um, Azure Blob Storage is, is a local file from my laptop, okay? From my laptop to Azure uh, Storage Blob, okay? How you can do it while using the PowerShell, okay? So but before I walk you through this code, let me show you my storage account where I will be uploading the um, a, a file, okay? A file is nothing but a picture file. I will be uploading to a storage account okay so this is my subscription and this is my storage account okay um, so inside the storage account I have a container called picture okay so inside this container I have, uh, will be uh, so uh, so this is my container where I will be uploading a file okay so as you see here currently it's a capture 15.jpg file is there now I will show you how we can upload one more file with the name capture capture 16.jpg file okay so this is the path of the file in uh, from my local system okay so let me load it and after that um, um, I am getting the name of the uh, that file by using this command okay and after that uh, so this is the HTTP, HTTP hosted host name of my Azure storage account okay so this you can get it from your storage account and after that as I showed you this is my container henceforth my container name becomes picture yeah and this is the SAS token okay so this is my SAS token you need a SAS token here right so henceforth I have retrieved my SAS token from the uh, my Azure storage account okay with the SAS token, you can do anything on the storage account. Okay? Be careful, this is very sensitive. Okay, for this demo, I have created a SAS token which gets expired within one day. Okay, henceforth, I am confident and I am just showing you here. Whereas uh, for your purpose, okay, please do not show it, show this SAS token um, um, to publicly. Okay, that is my recommendation. Okay, yeah, and after that, um, um, finally, I am creating the REST API URL. Okay, so this. So this is the syntax of um, creating the REST API for Azure storage account. Okay, so this is uh, so let me run this and I will show you how that REST API will be automatically um, uh, formed via this syntax. Okay, so here you go. This is my REST API became now which is um, working. Okay, and uh, this is the REST, REST API which will help us to upload my file from local laptop to my storage account. Okay, so to generate okay to generate that rest api we need to follow standard syntax okay one is uh, first one will be your https storage host name okay and forward, forward slash your container name okay and what is the container name inside your storage account yeah and after that if you have the folder structure then you will be providing the folder structure or else you will be directly go ahead with the forward slash the name of your file okay here file name is capture.16 capture16.jpg and after that, I am giving the SAS token. Okay, the SAS token format is something starts with the question mark. Okay, if you are, if the question mark is not there, you need to put it question mark. Okay, so hence for the you my URL become like this. Okay, yeah. So this is my URL now. After that, I am creating a header. Okay, so this is the the standard header format for block block blob. Okay, so this is the header became this is my header which became now. Yeah, and after that, you are finally um, if you, you are finally can invoke your um, invoke REST method. Uh, command to to put your um, uh, the local file to uh, the Azure Blob Storage. Okay, so, okay. So uh, let me do that by clicking this URL. Okay. So as you see, it is running. Here you go. It is in in a less than a second. Okay. It has just now successfully ran it, and it has already uploaded the that uh, file. Okay. This bar Blob file that is captured at 16 should be there under now that container. Okay. So let me refresh it. Here you go. The capture16.jpg file has been successfully uplo uploaded from my local system to my storage account. Okay, so this is a, a general demo of how you can use the PowerShell Azure Power PowerShell to upload uh, the any uh, files to to Azure Blob Storage. Okay, so this is just a demo, demo for the same purpose. Okay, and since it's a demo and it's a, it's a way way of how to use that same um, scenarios, whereas this same scenario can be implemented um, uh, wherever it is required at your automations or, or, or at your applications. Okay. Okay, yeah. Um, so uh, with that note, we have just shown you how you can do the same task here. Um, uh, with that note, thanks for uh, watching my videos. And a final kind request: please do subscribe my channel. That would really encourage me a lot. Okay. With that note, thank you. Thanks a lot.